January had some impressive temperature spreads recorded at SeaTac Airport from just 15 degrees in the morning on the 12th and 13th all the way up to 61 in the afternoon on the 28th and 29th. In fact, on the 29th, the mercury hit 69 degrees in Bellingham, according to the National Weather Service. In just the last week, we had three January days in a row of temps of 60 or above in Seattle. The NWS says that hadn't happened in 43 years. So what comes next? According to the National Weather Service's Climate Prediction Center, there is a 33 to 40 percent chance of above normal temperatures for the next 8 to 14 days. When it comes to getting some moisture to rebuild our snowpack, government forecasters say we can expect a 33 to 40 percent chance of below normal precipitation in the next two weeks. Looking further out, the National Weather Service is calling for spring-like temperatures for much of the country, including western Washington in the month of February. But don't expect to see a lot of extra rain. The newest monthly precipitation forecast has a 40 to 50 percent chance of below normal amounts of rain and snow. For skiers, that is not good news when it comes to putting fresh powder on our slopes. Theron's on Como News.